What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video gonna learn how to fix this annoying issue into Elementor WordPress Page Builder plugin. It happens into the free version, into the premium version, sometimes independently if you have the same site in two hosts but in one it happens in other than not. As you can see into my widgets from the left side bar of my news right here, we have no inner section, we have just a container but this container isn't customizable just like the inner section we can make it full widget for example how to fix this and how to restore how to come back with the inner section this is what you're gonna learn in this video but for the solution please take a moment to hit the subscribe button like this video and share this content with a friend of yours you have no idea how much that helps us because i bring daily videos about wordpress SEO plugins optimizations and many many more topics in order to choose internet on a site's favor so let's get this started very first thing to do it's navigate to your wordpress dashboard let me go back to my dashboard review the left side bar menus and hover your mouse over elementor okay now click into the sub menu settings from here you're gonna be able to open the configuration panel from elementor plugin there is four tabs right here, general, integrations, advanced and features. We're gonna search for features, okay? And we're gonna scroll it down just a little bit. Keep scrolling. There is a lot of experiments that you can do right here into Elementor, okay? And some of them creates a lot of issues on your site basically. So the one that is making our inner section not appear is this guy right here flexbox container it's set as default what do you need to do we need to set this as inactive container based content will be hidden from our site no problem just deactivate okay now it saved it automatically for me but remember to click into the save changes just to double check now let's open up our elementor i'm gonna move to page add new Click into edit with Elementor in order to open up the Elementor editor. And as you can see now, we have our inner section back to our site. And this is one of my favorite and most important elements from Elementor plugin, okay? So the inner section is truly, truly important because have the stretch section option and we have fixed the issue if you still have the issue let me know into the comment section below and of course if you have any question do the same use the comment section below so we can talk to you and that is hope you guys enjoyed this video feel free to choose the comment section below in the case that you have any question don't forget to check out our barless plugin to gain widgets elements templates and tools to build up your site or enzo wordpress team the best free wordpress team that you can start to customize your site in the way that you want our growth.net platform, a place where we can submit our sites or our blogs for receiving and publishing guest posts. Our sites.gallery, that is a CSS gallery site that you can promote your site, your app, your landing page, your game design, all for free. And in the case you want to go premium while you're doing your site, go to visualmodel.com, purchase the Visual Model Pass and unlock full access to our entire templates library with hundreds of pre-built that can import with a single click. In addition for premium icons, assets, blocks, templates, plugins, themes, and many, many more features, including our support. And that is, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I see you tomorrow. All the best.